So guys, it's like six o'clock in the morning. Today is a long travel day for us. Me and Lori are packed up, getting ready. We're gonna head over to the shop and then here, early afternoon, we're heading to the airport and we're gonna be heading to China. That's right, that's a long trip to China. And I've had many of these really long travel days. So uh, they're exciting, nerve wracking, all kinds of emotions go on. This is the first time I've ever been in China and we're gonna have some really amazing adventures for you guys. So over the next 10, 11 days, these vlogs are gonna be some pretty radical, awesome times. But for now, gotta get to the building, finish some things up and then get back, pick up our luggage and hit the airport. The next time I lay my head on a bed will be in Shanghai about 26 hours from now. <laughs> To give you guys an, an idea of how last minute I do everything, literally, Steph right here <laughs> is, is working on my presentation for my speech. Uh, and literally it is almost 12.30 and I am supposed to be heading to the airport at 12.30 and, uh, and it certainly isn't Steph's fault because I brought this to her actually at the very end of the day yesterday said, oh, by the way, I need this PowerPoint thing done. So uh, totally my fault. And she's been busting her butt all day long trying to get it to me. And uh, maybe if I planned a little better, this wouldn't have happened, but uh, we'll get it there. It's gonna work out, not, not even worried about it. Thank you guys for everything. Nico, a man, Trebalicious. Love you. Right. Oh, Perfect. be oh. careful. Okay, oh, away we go. All right guys, see you later. <laughs> Both got pulled uh, in the security line, and <laughs> basically got uh, you know the, the whole the whole full Monty thing there. It wasn't that bad. They were really nice, but but it was kind of funny when I went through the little X-ray thing. There was actually a square box right over my uh, right area, so uh, I have no idea what that was. But <laughs> I got a pretty good pat down. Uh, surprised they didn't charge me money for that one. Uh, and uh, and then they pulled our bags and had to swap everything. But it's all good. We're good now. Off to the gate. made it to the gate um, this is when that reality hits you that you're gonna go on a uh, 15 hour plane ride and uh, once you're off you're on it no matter what so uh, it should be interesting but the next 10 days are gonna be pretty exciting you know it's always a little nerve-wracking when you're going to a place you've never been you really don't know what to expect but that's kind of the sense of adventure of it too so uh, I think it's gonna be really cool so we'll be in uh, obviously tonight which will be actually there tomorrow and uh, there's a 12 hour time difference so right now it's uh, coming up on 3 o'clock we'll left at 3 o'clock and leave at 4.30 uh, and it's, so it's uh, 4.30 in the morning their time so I think we land right around right around 6 o'clock their time at night so uh, we'll uh, get down we'll uh, check it out you know maybe see the city a little bit and try to get some seas the next day uh, we're gonna head out to Disneyland I think so uh, go check that out that's our one day off in Shanghai so it uh, should be a blast but uh, for now it's just waiting for that plane to board we just got word that our plane is busted so uh, apparently <laughs> the engine's not Great working so, so that's uh that always makes you feel good when you're gonna hop on a plane for 15 hours and they're like oh by the way your engines broke <laughs> But uh, so unfortunately, we have about a three hour delay while they hopefully fix the engine, uh, whatever. So we're just gonna go get some food. Yeah. Doesn't look like we're gonna be out of here anytime soon, but we'll see what happens. Well, after a four hour delay, we're finally gonna be boarding and on our way. So I'm already exhausted and I still have a 15 hour flight and I don't see Once again, flight, we're so boarding those passengers through the sky road and landing plane. those. All right, so we made it 
onto the plane. Uh, Lori's got some nice leg room there. Not fancy. <laughs> and uh, we have uh, a long time sitting here now. We'll be able to sleep maybe. She'll be sleeping and I'll be watching movies. So uh, here's our view. So uh, that's it for the next 14-15 uh, hours. One eternity later. So about 11 hours into the flight now, about two, two and a half hours to go. I gotta tell you, unless you've been on a plane for 12 hours, you don't know what it feels like. But so far it's been an okay flight, but I am absolutely exhausted. I uh, can't wait to be landing again, maybe two, two and a half hours left to go. We got to the airport. Uh, it's like 10 o'clock at night, Shanghai time, uh, just getting our baggage. Uh, and then we're gonna head to the hotel. Hopefully the person that's supposed to be picking us up is here. I have no idea how to get in touch with her if she doesn't pick us up. So it'll be interesting. Uh, and it's always nerve wracking to make sure that the, uh, the baggage is here. So uh, hopefully it all goes well. So guys, this room is pretty fancy. I'm pretty shocked. You know, you never know when you're traveling uh, what someone's gonna put you up in, but uh, it's pretty cool. I'll give you the quick tour real quick. This is actually like a, a living area here. Got a little couch and hang out, which is pretty awesome. Got like a half bath in here. We had a little bit of a mishap and uh, protein powder inside the suitcase exploded. Uh, not as bad as, as it could have been, so that's okay. And then, uh, Here's the uh, the bedroom here. So this is pretty darn nice. I mean, it's it's pretty awesome. We've got some fancy robes. I'm gonna wear those later for sure. And then uh, even the bathroom's pretty darn cool for. Again, sometimes, especially uh, when you're traveling to to Asia, um, sometimes you know things are really small. And and I don't I don't mind it at all. But this is beautiful. This is a really good spot. But anyways, guys, we have literally we left our house. Uh, just shy of 30 hours ago like 29 hours ago and again when we left it was already you know 1 30 or 2 o'clock in the afternoon so we'd already been up for six or seven hours so literally the last time i slept was about 35 or 36 hours ago so we're going to get some sleep tonight uh wake up early we're actually tomorrow we we're going to do disney originally but now we're doing that later in the trip and we're going to go to some zoo tomorrow so tomorrow we'll have a really cool vlog about some Chinese zoo would have no idea what it's about. So uh, anyways, uh, I'm getting some sleep guys. Good night. See you guys tomorrow